Hi, okay, so today we're going to make two products using the Thieves Household Cleaner. As you know, I'm all about getting rid of the toxins from your home. You can't control the air that you breathe outside of your home, but you can definitely control the quality of the air inside of your home. And so that's why I'm all about getting rid of the toxins and replacing them with products that are more economical. So this is what I'm going to use. This is the Thieves Household Cleaner. So because this is really heavy to lift and try to measure, it's 1.8 liters, I believe. Yeah. So that's almost like 1.8 kilograms when it's full. So I decanted into one of these. So I've actually put a label on there. So this can't be confused with a drink. So you know this is the diluted, or no, this is the concentrated household cleaner. So I'm going to first make a spray, all-purpose cleaner, and then I'm going to make a cleaning paste, which is a little bit more abrasive. So it's kind of like your comparable to cream cleanser or um, gumption or something like that. So we first start with this. I have a 500 ml glass bottle. I prefer glass over plastic if, if that's possible. I put a label on it again so I know exactly what it is. So I do house cleaning for people and this is what I find. I may be a little bit heavy handed with the ingredients um, but that's because I use it for absolutely everything. Glass, mirrors, um, leather, wood, carpet, uh, whatever you can think of that gets dirty, I use it on that. I even use it to clean my car sometimes. Um, okay, so you start with a 500 ml spray bottle. You fill it up with purified water and then you just add, I'll just use a funnel just to make sure I don't tip it out all over the place. Actually, I might have put too much water in here. <laughs> okay, funnel. I put one tablespoon full of the concentrated Thieves Household Cleaner. And then I put one tablespoon full of El Cheapo white vinegar. And the reason I do that, I add the vinegar because it's a little bit more, um, oops, a little bit more volatile than just the household cleaner, which means that it evaporates off of glass much quicker and so it doesn't leave streaks. So it's as simple as that. And then you just, I always use the um, microfiber cloths because again, that also removes a lot of, lot of dirt. So there you go, there's your Thieves Household Cleaner. Fantastic. So now I'm going to make um, this paste. So what you get is one cup full of bicarb of soda, sodium bicarbonate, baking soda, whatever you want to call it one cup full and again I put one tablespoon full of Thieves Household Cleaner in there and just mush it around and then one tablespoon full of vinegar so it's going to start to fizz up so you just have to stir it really quickly so it doesn't fizz up too much okay and then you just give it a stir make sure it's all the ingredients are mixed in very thoroughly And it makes a paste, it makes a beautiful paste. And it actually smells quite divine because it contains the Thieves essential oil blend. And Thieves, as we know, contains some very powerful um, essential oils. So it's got lemon, rosemary, eucalyptus, cinnamon, and clove. So there you've got a, a nice paste. And then I just transfer that into a jar. I love recycling so I've got an old salsa jar here and I just put it in here and then of course you got to have a label on it so nobody puts that on their toast in the morning so you know exactly what's in here and just about fills up this jar. So that's it. I will uh, write the recipe in the comments section so you don't have to watch it over and over. You'll know exactly what to put in there. So you've got your cleaning spray and your gumption abrasive. So that's really good for cooktops, even for cleaning your oven, things like that. Okay, that's it. Thanks. Bye.